Now, we have this question, if this sigma is 665, then find the value of n. Here, we have first sigma for m is equal to p to n and then we have sigma for p is equal to 1 to n. What do we do first? First, we simplify this term. For that, we expand both this binomial coefficients. We have n factorial divided by n minus m factorial multiply by m factorial multiply by m c p is m factorial over m minus p factorial multiply by p factorial. Okay. Here, m factorial gets cancelled out. Okay. Now, uh, here in first sigma, in this sigma, we have a variable m. So, we keep factorials having m here and other factorials we can take out from the uh, sign of sigma. So, we have sigma for p is equal to 1 to n of n factorial divided by p factorial multiply by sigma for m is equal to p to n of 1 upon n minus m factorial multiply by m minus p factorial. Okay. So, basically we have this sigma, then we multiply it with n factorial over p factorial and then we apply sigma uh, to the result for p is equal to 1 to n. Pehle hum ye sigma nikalenge, usko hum isse multiply karenge aur jo result aega, fir uske par ye sigma apply karenge. Thik hai na? Okay, now uh, to get this sigma, I need to create one binomial coefficient here. For that, I add n minus m and m minus p and this sum is n minus p. So, in numerator, I write n minus p factorial. I am multiplying by n minus p factorial here. Now, this is constant with respect to m. m ke respect mein ye constant hai. Okay. So, uh, we divide by n minus p factorial here. We write n minus p factorial here. Okay. Now, this is n minus p c m minus p and uh, this is n c so, we have this sum. Okay. Now, we first evaluate this sigma. Okay. Now, uh, to get this sum, I expand this. We have uh, n minus p c 0, when I put m is equal to p, this is 0. Then uh, I put here m is equal to p plus 1, I get n minus p c 1, next term is n minus p c 2 and so on and last term is n minus p c n minus p, when I put here m is equal to n. Uh, this sum is 2 power n minus p, this is complete series uh, with prefix n minus p uh, with index of binomial n minus p. Okay, so, iska sum ho jayega 2 power n minus p. So, now we have uh, sigma for p is equal to 1 to n of n c p multiplied by 2 power n minus p. Hume ab ye sigma evaluate karna hai. Okay, na? To hum iske terms likh lete hai. Uh, terms are Iske terms ko mein yahan pe likh leta hu. S is equal to, uh, suppose this sum is S. So, S is equal to, when I put P is equal to 1, I get N C 1 multiply by 2 power N minus 1. Uh, then we have term N C 2 multiply by 2 power N minus 2 and so on. And last term is N C N multiply by uh, 2 power 0. Now, this is not complete binomial expansion. One term is missing constant term missing here. We have uh, n c 0 multiplied by 2 power n, this term is missing. So, we add this term and uh, uh, subtract this term. Okay. Now, from n c 0 2 power n to n c n 2 power 0, this is binomial expansion of uh, uh, some expression. Kya hoga wo expression? This is binomial expansion of 2 plus 1 power n, ye iska uh, expansion aega na, chik hai, minus this is 2 power n. So, we are getting 3 power n minus 2 power n as some s, 
तो इसका जो सम है वो क्या हो जाएगा थ्री पावर एन माइनस टू पावर एन ओके नो दिस इज गिवन सिक्स सिक्सटी फाइव फ्रॉम दिस वी टू गेट वैल्यू ऑफ एन आप बता सकते हैं यहां पे एन का वैल्यू क्या होगा थ्री पावर फाइव इज टू फोर्टी थ्री थ्री पावर सिक्स इज सेवन ट्वेंटी नाइन सो वी कैन ट्राई विथ एन इज इक्वल टू सिक्स फॉर एन इज इक्वल टू सिक्स वी हैव सेवन ट्वेंटी नाइन माइनस टू पावर सिक्स इज सिक्सटी फोर एंड दिस डिफरेंस इज सेवेंटी टू माइनस सिक्स सिक्सटी सिक्स दिस इज सिक्स सिक्स फाइव सो वैल्यू ऑफ एन इज इक्वल टू सिक्स so uh, here we have similar kind of question let's try some more questions uh, in this group now we have this one find uh, some sigma of uh, minus 1 power r multiplied by 4 power 10 minus r multiplied by 30 cr multiplied by 30 minus r c 10 minus r so in first step we simplify this term for that we expand this two binomial coefficients okay so we have 30 factorial over 30 minus r factorial multiply by r factorial this is 30 minus r factorial over 10 minus r factorial multiply by 20 factorial okay now here 30 minus r factorial gets cancel out 30 factorial over 20 factorial is constant so uh, we have some s is equal to 30 factorial over 20 factorial multiply by sigma for r is equal to 0 to 10 of minus 1 power r multiply by 4 power 10 minus r multiply by 1 upon in denominator we have product of r factorial and 10 minus r factorial now to get the sum uh, for this general term for r is equal to 0 to 10 i uh, need to create here one binomial coefficient hame yahan pe ek binomial coefficient create karna padega theek hai hum tabhi sum nikal sakte hain how you create here binomial coefficient ab to ye bahut hi common approach hai we add r and 10 minus r sum is 10 so we need 10 factorial in numerator so here we multiply by 10 factorial outside we divide by 10 factorial this is uh, 30 c 10 okay so we have 30 c 10 multiply by sigma for r is equal to 0 to 10 of this is now uh, 10 c r okay multiply by 4 power 10 minus r multiply by minus 1 power r and this is uh, uh, the sigma is clearly expansion of this binomial 4 minus 1 power 10 theek hai na this is 3 so we have 30 c 10 multiply by 3 power 10 